uh, there's an event called the Horse Show Hustle on in uh, Crystal on August 7th, and it's for Brainwave. And I'm with Peter Murphy, who is with Brainwave Ireland. Hi, Peter. Hi, how are you doing? You're going to tell us what the Horse Show Hustle is. And um, it's actually nothing really to do with a horse show. We'll uh, start there. Okay, well, traditionally, traditionally Brainwave has uh, organised uh, a formal black tie event in, uh, for 33 years in the Burlington Hotel. Yep. It's uh, Dublin's oldest charity uh, board. And um, that was originally set up by the uh, crowd uh, 33 years ago that were involved in the Dublin Horse Show at the time and okay. the local hunt clubs. Yep. Uh, but over time that link has sort of um, uh, sort of withered away to the point now where um, it's a brand name almost. Uh, okay. Or it was until last year at least. Right. So on August 7th there's a fundraising night for Brainwave, which is the Irish Epilepsy Association. Right. Okay. What what's epilepsy and how many people in Ireland has have it? Well, epilepsy is actually the second most common neurological or, or brain disorder. Um, about 37,000 people in Ireland have it. Uh, that's from a recent study that, that, that Brainwave ourselves have actually conducted. And um, it's basically it's, uh, it's a, it basically describes a tendency to have seizures. And seizures are, I mean, there are many different types of seizures, but I suppose people would mostly um, you know, think of them as, uh, for example, absent seizures would involve people uh, who, who appear maybe to stare into space for maybe like 10, 15, 20 seconds. That's a form of a seizure that you know, maybe some people might be aware of. And of course, then there's atomic clonic seizures, um, or as used to be called, grand malice, which I suppose most people would think that's the convulsive seizure that involves people falling down, the stiffening of the limbs, etc. So they'd be the, 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 the two most common types of seizures, but there are many, many different types. And 37,000 people in the country have it. Yeah, 37,000 people above the age of five um, have diagnosed epilepsy. And what, what will the money that's raised at the Horseshoe Hustle do for Brainwave? What, what do you do? Okay, well, Brainwave is the national, there's, we're, we're the only uh, charity, the only organisation in Ireland that, uh, that uh, provides information support and um, well, a very wide range of services to people with epilepsy and to families and also to medical professionals that support people with epilepsy. So, for example, in terms of, of what we do uh, on a day-to-day -day basis for people with epilepsy, we have support groups, we have um, we have a helpline service, we have uh, specialist nurses that we've employed, um, we we organise uh, uh, support groups for, for people, we have awareness days and educational seminars, and we have um, and like a national conference every year that you know can get maybe three four hundred people in attendance. Um, then around the country, we have nine regional offices where the um, staff there are involved in, in, in meeting people on a one-to-one -one basis and advising them and ensuring that they are getting uh, the most, I suppose, um, and that their you know, quality of life, I suppose, is, uh, is, is maximised. Um, so, uh, apart from the actual one-to-one -one services, we also we have a, a pre-employment training course for young people with epilepsy that we run then in the Institute of Technology. Uh, in Sligo. We also, um, in recent years, have got very much involved in supporting research. Um, and actually, this year we'll be hope we're hoping to invest quite a lot of money in research. Um, uh, maybe three, four different projects that we're hoping to uh, uh, to fund among Irish doctors and scientists. Um, and we also, as I said, we also try and raise awareness about epilepsy, both among the public and among medical professionals, and try to educate uh, and improve awareness among uh, employers as well. And, and, schools and teachers and um, government departments. So it's a very wide, it's very wide, yeah, indeed, oh very wide range. Of and services. tickets for the Horse and Hustle are? Tickets for the Horse and Hustle are 30 euro. Okay, and so that 30 euro goes to Brain Life. Yeah. But what do I get for my 30 euro? What do you get? Uh, you get a great night out. Okay. Okay. That. Um, we have a really good lineup of, 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 of live music. We have uh, I mean, some of, of Dublin's best live acts uh, established and new and up and coming. We have David Kitt, mm -hmm. who I think most people will know. Uh, we have the uh, chapters, who are one of you know the big things coming out of Dublin at the moment. And um, we have History of Harry and All Star Charge, two other new bands that have heard so many good things about. There's also then DJ and Crystal as well, obviously. And there's a big raffle on the night, fantastic raffle, um, with some. Some really some great players. The reason Crystal is involved is because actually Crystal are donating this as. Well, oh, Crystal are donating their. Uh, for the so it's not yeah. just a, a posh event and they have to be one no, of the. No, ah, no, no, not at all. I no. mean, it could, be, it could be in the local community centre in many ways. We have a big yeah. night out. It could, it's, it's live music, it's have a few pints, it's bring your friends along. 
Um, it's uh, it's a night out like maybe any other Friday or Saturday night, except we have a lot of good entertainment and it's all in a good cause. And uh, all the things I was talking about, the money that's raised will, uh, you know, will support those services that I've just mentioned. And uh, you know, particularly the year that's in it and the times that's in it, uh, you know, um, everyone's support is really needed and really and really, uh, you know, uh, appreciated now as well. One of the really great things is a raffle. You have an amazing raffle going on. And tickets yeah. are only a fiver. Tickets are only a fiver, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, you know, it's, uh, I mean, put it this way, it is, it's amazing what the fiver can, uh, can get you nowadays. We, uh, first prize in the raffle is basically a year's worth of uh, weekends away. We look after you for five five weekends in or in, all in one package to some of the best hotels around the country. Wow. Park Hotel in Kenmare, two, two really class hotels down in Connemara, the Cullen Estate in Belfast, all the, they're all like four or five star hotels with uh, amazing spas and everything. And second prize itself is another amazing prize. It's a five, um, a five night stay on, the, on a, on a, on a Shannon cruiser um, for four people. That's worth it. If you want to go in August, that's worth about 800 quid. So for a fiver, yeah, it's pretty good, I think. And there's some sports packages. Anyone that's interested in football, we've got tickets for the Ireland Italy match. We've got free bets for Paddy Power. We've got uh, GA tickets, we've got uh, loads of other kit stuff, um, and I, I, I can't remember, but there are more, just more Yeah, no, I will list them on, <laughs> on, on Coach.ie uh, under this video. Um, what time is it on at? It's from 9 o'clock. From 9, 9 o'clock, Friday 7th of August, mm -hmm. and tickets are available on Tickets.ie, tickets yeah. or by ringing your office. Or by ringing us, yeah, 7500. Brilliant. That's where you can get the tickets. And uh, if you get there early, you might even get a free pint. Nice. <laughs> there we go. Great. Thanks very much. Thanks.